What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Spy Family. Today we are doing episode 18. This one is called Uncle the Private Tutor slash Daybreak. Now you guys did let me know I missed the omelet something after credit scene last episode. So I'm absolutely going to watch that and then I'm going to get into episode 18, find out what else is going to be hilarious, what other Anya shenanigans we can get into. I am very excited. Hopefully you guys are as well. If you are, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below in that comment section. Make sure you guys subscribe. If you guys have not subscribed yet, click that notifications bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. And then obviously check out that Patreon for the full uncut versions as well as early access and uncuts to the other shows I'm watching. Let's hop right on into it um ending spy family episode 17 and then spy family episode 18 let's do it okay end of mission 17 omelet rice uh-oh you're cooking something for yuri it's gonna be disgusting but he's gonna love it itadakimasu oh oh yep exactly my point exactly my actual point Oh, so this was the start of her home cooking endeavor. Nothing here. I like how they're blurring it out. That's how you know it's bad. Like, this is like, they're censoring this. This is NSFW. God damn. Your is hilarious. <laughs> and so, okay, that's a good way to transition into that. And so this man gained an invincible body. He was raised by your stayed up for four days gets hit by a truck literally nothing <laughs> interesting so i think they're setting up uh yuri playing a big part in this next episode that was funny okay and this is episode 18 <laughs> let's do it midterms okay and stella's will, re will be rewarded damn we gotta make sure these kids are educated she seems a little overconfident. Normally when Anya's confident, she gets humbled. Oof. That's no bueno. Look at that face. That's no bueno. Oh. <laughs> Even though I'm, I'm never an advocate for cheating like that. But... Mr. Moon. How she talks is so funny to me. So this is serious? So her power is somehow tied to the lunar cycle? And in two weeks when the exam happens is the end of the lunar phase. And so this is how Yuri's going to come in and teach us. <laughs> she just, all her, all her frets and worries immediately went away. Right? That's how it'd be. You're like, oh shit, I was worried about that. おじ。アンキ。来たよ、姉さん。あ、やろ。いらっしゃい、ゆり。お久しぶり、ゆりくん。うん。なんでいるんだろう、どうじゃ。They're Dopey-faced gremlin. <laughs> Imperial scooter. What a little angel. Now that he knows she's... <laughs> right? Now that he knows she's gonna be buying lots of yummy things <laughs> for, for your... That's hilarious. Knowledge is most definitely power. Most definitely. <laughs> Unleash, no leash. Meanwhile, Bonds is over there being cute. Have you mastered this grammar lesson yet? 
And why are you guys laying on the floor exhausted? Have you mastered this grammar? What's grammar? Now Yo Yuri's uh, re-motivated as well. He's like, how can I teach her when I'm not even at my maximum potential? That's all he needed to hear through the wall. Oh, <laughs> and he's gone just like that. I mean, there are always areas that we can improve ourselves on physically and mentally, you know. I like it, I like it. How commendable. <laughs> Poor Bond. He, he died. R.I.P. Bond. Such a good doggo. Yeah, I mean, it's always good to learn, like, new languages and other things, but we should probably study the subjects that are going to be on our test, you know? When you see that no leash is No, Anya might be one of the funniest kids ever, I swear to God. So this is daybreak. We're getting the results of the test. Trying to buy, huh? I thought, I'm sure at a rich school like this, that would be a thing. Our principal will never allow such things. I like their commitment to, to being straight line, you know? Good. Oh, so they keep the answer sheets in the most secure vault. Okay, is Lloyd going to break in here? This is his plan to help her. Facts. So, he's disguised. Feels like we're playing like Hitman right now, you know? Yeah, well, yeah, who? His name is Daybreak? What? What? Who? Under... So he's from the East. He's from Austania. Twilight of the West. Daybreak. Isn't Twilight... Obviously Lloyd's spy nickname, but isn't the term Twilight like something to do with sun and moon? Like when... I know Daybreak is obviously when the sun first peaks, breaks over the horizon, you know? Get the sun set. Is it? Cause wasn't there something called like Twilight Zone? I don't know. Is you guys? I kind of like the 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 wordology. That's not also not a word, but you guys know what I'm trying to say. This little roll, behold the beginning. This little hat. Bro, this guy. <laughs> hey. Bro, this dude's just somersaulting. Almost spit out that water. I swear to God. That was actually kind of slick, even though. <laughs> what? I know. It was uh, being able to flagpole like that is crazy. Bro, you can't leave any evidence that this happened, and this dude is straight just smashing windows. Okay, smart play, Lloyd. Good play. <laughs> he is technically blaming. The like, whoa, we didn't fucking do that. He's gonna have another. He has all the student ID or the. He just has ones ready, backup IDs for every subject in case he needed to impersonate someone else. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is that how Damien's been doing so well? You fucking idiot. Can you guys, because I don't have it in my notes, can you guys remind me, what's the name of Damien's older brother, the one that he is very, he lives in the shadow of? He actually got Lloyd? Yeah, he's just pretending he's knocked out. Talk about celebrating.
TTYL, brother. I hate this dude so much. I hate him. I hate him so much. Oh, really? I thought that's how Damien's been passing, but no, Damien's been doing well, and they're altered to make him fail. Demetrius. Okay. Perfect scores. Okay, Demetrius. See, this is something that I think Japanese schools do, because I see this in all the shows and all the animes, and I see this in Persona 5. They post the scores publicly for everyone to see. It sounds kind of something that America or the West wouldn't do because it promotes you being ashamed if you don't do well. But I'm all about that. I'm like, hey, if you want, like, it's like, uh, I'm like, I like this. Like, I would actually like this over here in the West. I don't know. Does that sound bad? Does that sound weird? Let me know your guys' opinion on that. Because I would never be the top five, top 10, top 50. Top, I'm talking about like my whole grade, but I was, I was a pretty smart kid. You know what I'm saying? 11th place overall. Okay, Damien. See, with your friends seeing that? It's got to be a good... Look at that. Look at that feeling. Come on. I remember in Persona 5, uh, I would get extra... I think, what was it? I forget. You'd get something special for being in like the top 10 in your class, you know? 213? Oh, it's not... She's not going to get any bolts, but she's not going to get any Stella either. Or perfectly average. <laughs> hey, man. You gotta be optimistic. I like Becky's little bomb hairpin. It's kind of cool. <laughs> That's not how that works, Yor, but I love it. Okay, Stella needed to become an Imperial or Imperial Scooter, as she said. Seven. Bolts until Expulsion, also seven. Knowledge plus five. It literally feels like we're playing Persona 5, I swear. <laughs> Goddamn Daybreak, you hate to see it. You hate to see it. Well, uh, that was all about midterms. I thoroughly enjoyed that episode. I thought it was going to be more about Yuri tutoring, but no, I, I, I like was partial that, which is always fun and a good time seeing Yuri and his little, this little greedy little imp, you know, all that. And then she's an angel. His, his personality is quite funny and his love for his sister. Um, but I think the funniest part was obviously daybreak in this episode is him doing those somersaults and flag pulling like so extra, such an idiot. But we are starting to slowly, slowly develop more and more interest in the, the Donovan brothers. I'm just curious how how deep, like, how, how when are we going to get to that? You know, like, I'm not in any rush or anything, but uh, we're, we're building some character development and rapport with Damien, which I like. But I want to meet Demetrius. I want to meet Donovan. I want to see more. I want to find out how important of a role they play in the story. All that jazz. Uh, but I thoroughly enjoyed this episode. Hopefully you guys did. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Don't forget to check out that Patreon for that full uncut versions. Also early access and uncuts to the other shows I'm watching. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace out.